Hey traders, Mike Sir here. I want to record this video to give you guys an update in regards to the uh, US stock market. Uh, some of you have been watching my videos. I've been talking about the pending US stock market crash or correction. And it looks like um, we are starting to see signs of that. So I want to give you guys my analysis of the S&P 500 index. And uh, let's see where this uh, potentially stock market crash or correction uh, will continue. So here you can see a chart of the S&P 500. These were the lows set in March of 2020 uh, when the COVID pandemic was at its worst. And you can see the markets have really risen sharply after that. And one thing, if you guys have been watching my videos is um, I've been drawing this pattern. This is basically a wedge. You can see that the pattern in terms of the wedge pattern is is quite wide and then keeps getting tighter and tighter and tighter and usually this is a very very bearish pattern so it's a negative pattern so what we did see yesterday is we saw a break right out of this wedge pattern so we've broken the uptrend uh, for now and what is surprising is the markets stopped right here at this support level right here and it just bounced off it. So what I am suspecting is that um, it will at some point test this level again, which is 42.34, which is the low that was hit. At some point it will test it. Um, what I kind of see for C for now is either we kind of go sideways, especially since the S&P dropped over 2% uh, yesterday and what I would suspect is that either we bounce up back to this level here, this line, that where it broke, or we kind of just go sideways for a bit and then break here. So if it does break this line, what I am looking for is probably either down to around the 4,000 level, 39.90 around here. If we do break this, uh, we do have some type of uh, support around here, but uh, this is kind of what I'm looking for. Now, one of the things that the market has uh, reacted uh, so negatively um, last week was obviously a lot of very, very uh, bad inflation data. The fact that inflation is getting out of control. Uh, the other aspect uh, the market is reacting to this negatively is that there is a uh, a rising amount of cases of, of COVID, uh, especially of the Delta variant, and that is causing some concern uh, in the market. Now, as of right now, if you kind of look at the bigger picture, uh, this is not a huge um, drop uh, so far, uh, but what I did say to you guys is that uh, this type of wedge pattern is very, very negative. So we should see in terms of this type of uh, a big wedge pattern, is to see further downside. So I wouldn't be surprised. Again, I'm not here to try to uh, predict what the market's going to do. Um, the market will tell us, but um, if it breaks the lows of this level right here, uh, I do suspect that we go even lower. Now, things could change. Um, and what I'll do is um, I will give you guys an update uh, for those who want to follow me uh, on Twitter. You can look under my name, Mike Sir, uh, under my Twitter handle and get updates from there. So I'll see you guys uh, in the next video.